All right. Medium convoy detected in La Paz. Hybrid medium convoy. Hybrids are secretly transporting goods and resources. Intercept this convoy before it disappears. Ooh. Well, that is definitely uh, new. All right. Depending on how long that takes, that'll probably be the last mission of the stream. Uh, Rufert, let's go ahead and get you on board. Uh, Equipment-wise... What do we got? Uh, I should probably sell some stuff, that's for sure. Uh, looks pretty good. I think we got everything that we need, then. Wow, four on uh, Nomad Fly. Uh, six on the Wilhelm Scream. All right, Cave Carrot. I think that's going to be a daytime mission, which hopefully will be good. All right, we're going to want to try and capture a lot of these people alive. Because these should be uh, new units and different music. All right, we have intercepted a hybrid shipment of resources. Make sure it doesn't reach its destination. To abort the mission, return the XCOM operatives to the transport vehicle and click on the abort mission icon. Uh, Reclusive Hero can get something else. In fact, he can get his uh, SMG back. I am quite unsure as to what this music is supposed to be. <laughs> Froxus. Um. No. Actually, uh. Yeah, that's good. Pac Man Red. I want you to have this. Drop the grenade, and I don't really want to drop it. Yeah, we'll drop that. We'll take another uh, taser clip. I don't know, the dart rifles, they haven't been doing much for me. I'm not, not really uh, a fan of what they've been, uh, how effective they've been. Because they haven't been very effective, in my opinion. Uh, Kalinus, you can carry something else. Uh, another proximity grenade? No. You can carry that. That's good. North Star Avalon. Electric Club. Rufert, take those away. Uh, definitely give you one of these. I need you to hold a... Thing. Go ahead and take that. Yeah, just the XCOM files, and I've got the uh, the thirty turn um, bug hunt mode turned on as well. Guess I'll take another clip. Oh, hi. Already. Alien hybrid with a knife and a chem pistol. This weapon shoots jets of pressurized, highly active chemicals. It is absolutely deadly to living targets and unprotected machinery. The chemical mixture can be produced from common ingredients, but is highly unusual and likely made with extraterrestrial guidance. Man, if only I had thought about that, knew, known about that, and brought bio suits. Bio exosuits. Well, that is not the edge of the map, either. It looked like it might have been. Okay, hello. Advent. Ah. Okay. 
Advent down there with a laser rifle, as you do. And another alien hybrid there. Well, let's take a look. Nope. No defense against chemical. I mean, it, like, the front armor may block most of the damage. All right, so what do you have? You've got a chem pistol. You've got a chem pistol, which I imagine doesn't have a very long range. You are the most dangerous one. Right, it's 100%, yeah. I.e., no defense. All right, I might take out these two guys and then get back into... Well, no, I can't get back into the craft, really. All right, I'm going to take out this guy, though. No line of fire. There we go. Get back in. In fact, let's move everyone back. Don't do that, and that is a freaky sound, too. Alright, let's see how this goes. Oh, and they have mind control! Oh, that's, uh... That is... That's just lovely. That's, uh, that's fantastic. Alright, you have a flashbang grenade and a snub-nosed pistol. Alright, so that guy's not terribly dangerous. The laser rifle guy is, is by far the most dangerous. Um, unfortunately, I'm in a position where I have, like, no cover at all. You know what? I'm going to see if they come to me. Uh, who has my... There you go. Rufert has my motion scanner. Lovely, fantastic. I'm glad that uh, they're that far away. Those chem weapons are arcing, so not very accurate. Well, yeah, but it's still uh, damage that I don't have any special defense against. So I'd rather not deal with it. <laughs> Rather not test it out. That's also very annoying. I, that might not be a good reason to uh, stay in here. Um, they don't seem to be very strong, though, because they haven't been able to do a whole lot. Alright, so there is a guy right there. There's a guy there. Alright, pupper. Give me a look-see. Okay, still those two. So again, it's the laser rifle guy that I'm, I'm most worried about. I don't know where he went. He either went this way or he's hiding behind the van, I figure.
Also, I don't think my uh, pupper has uh, much defense right now. Combat gear, yeah. Alright, pupper, can you get up here? Yes, you can. That seems like it might be a good idea. We can see if there's anyone back here that needs their uh, nards ripped off. Okay, Zaku 2. Still only see those two. Alright, go ahead and uh, get back up here. Alright, we're just going to advance up to the front of the uh, craft for the moment. Get ready to come out uh, next round. I mean, those weapons might not actually be that bad. I don't know, but... Because I haven't encountered them before. I want to take it very carefully. Okay, Rufert. Okay, there is someone right down there. A guy with an RPG launcher. Hey, how's it going? Guess what? Oh, hey, lots of guys. Okay, Black Ops LMG, that's worrisome. Black Ops Rifle, not as worrisome, although I don't know whether they have uh, gotten their hands on Tritanium Ammo or not. Okay, down he goes. Get some cover there. Well, yeah, but, I mean, other people don't, and I still don't uh, want to take it. Uh, here's a question. Are are all of these uh, hybrids the same? Do you know if they're the same? Or are there different ranks of the hybrids and the advent guys in this mission? Because if they're all the same, then I'm going to just start killing the, re the rest of these uh, alien hybrids. There are different ranks of hybrids, but in this mission? Hybrid workers don't use Psy? Okay. That's a good point. Should be at least one supervisor. All right. All right. So then I do want to try to take as many alive as possible. Um, all right. Pac Man Red can get back up there, but Pac Man Red also does have the shield. What, uh,. I can do up to 70 damage, and it does have five shots. It's kinetic, although I guess it wouldn't do quite 70 damage because I've got some resistance. 80. He'd still definitely get through. Alright, um... Man Red, come down here. Alright, I'm going to assume that uh, the guy that, like, this guy with the chem pistol and a knife probably isn't very high ranking. Hybrids do have useful research to give you. Yeah, I'm not surprised. It's a hybrid specialist. Okay, so that's a that's a good one to get. Go ahead and hide back here for the moment. Froxus, get here. 
Star Avalon and Rufert, I'm going to get you here. And let's see what happens. It's pretty much always a specialist. That's good to know. Yeah. Like, I imagine that that guy with the uh, snub nosed pistol is. You dink. Don't kill my robot. How did they know that my robot was there anyway? Okay, yeah, see, that's that's what I'm talking about. That was, uh, you're, you're like, it shouldn't be very dangerous. A little annoyed that he moved away from uh, that spot. Moved away from us, I should say. Don't you shoot my doggy. Yes, shoot your people in the back of the head. Alright, we do have an injury. Pac-Man Red, two fatal wounds. Alright, you're okay. Uh... Is it just 100 for chem resist? Well, I mean, I would expect it to say something other than... Yeah, I mean, it, it should have a, a line like, you know, choke 400. So if we go in here, uh, defaults... Can we actually see? We can't see that here. Yeah, no stat is 100. That's what... It, yeah, so... But... I mean, it probably hit his side armor or something, but still. Check those chem weapon info? Well, I, I can't. Oh, well, 35. Uh, info... Like an armor ignoring element or something like that. Chem pistol tank. Armor pre-damage multiplier 10%. If that's what you're thinking of. I'm not sure exactly whether that means uh, it does 10% extra damage, or that means that it does... Uh, it ignores 10% of armor, or what, so... Uh, so before armor is reduced, it gets 10% extra damage. Alright. So it's actually doing about 39 damage. Well, that guy's injured. Well, it hasn't melted the armor. It didn't do any damage to the armor. Oh, you have a sniper rifle. Well, we can probably get more of these guys. Rip his nards off. He's got some wads of cash. Hybrid corpse. Sniper rifle. Right, so I figure it had to have hit the uh, the side armor. Oh shoot, not enough energy. Well, another target. Can you get all the way over there? You can. Must be risky. Only certain armors can be broken. Well, so are you saying that there's a chance that uh, he will then just not have armor after that. Side armor is better, alright. 
Or are you saying that it would, uh... Because you can take damage to the armor. I assume that when you say it melts the armor, it does armor damage. There we go. He is down. Oh, I think we actually killed him. Uh, Froxus, come over here. Let's we'll see if we can do some healing. Can't do anything there. So there was the Advent guy wandering around there. Oh, right, no, you still have another... Another bit. All right, I'll have to do that next round. All right, North Star Avalon. Can you get uh, here? Yes, you can. They probably have grenades, but I'm going to hope that they are not going to shoot their own people. Or blow up their own people. Which is not exactly the... Uh, wisest assumption to make, but we'll see what happens. Don't shoot my doggy! <laughs> he shoots up in the air, I love that. That could hurt. Boy, I'm glad he's a bad shot. Alright, there's a grenade coming our way. Yeah, let's not have that happen. What was the green? Was that, like, chemical? Uh-oh. That's bad. That's a lot of hits that just... Alright, there's another grenade. Well, that is a lot of people who are now injured. Uh, you do have those. Alright. Well. Get up here. Oh, you can't use that on yourself. Well, crap. <laughs> oh, man. Alright. And Lulu is almost dead. Excuse me, sir. Not enough energy. Well, shoot. Need to ask you to not do that. Hey, Guardsman J. Bravo, how's it going? beat you silly not enough energy okay there is this guy all the way down here keep 
go up here. Uh, Rufert can go uh, take care of our dog. Actually, I should go with this. Of course, now you kind of got a uh, back facing that guy, but we'll see what we can do about him. Seriously? Oh my lord. I just want to take them all alive, is that so wrong? Alright, this weapon it is. And not enough. I should have gotten that out earlier. All right, well. All right, let's see how badly this turn goes. And another grenade. Alright, let's go back a couple, uh, a couple turns. You bought Suikoden 2, got it for a really good deal on eBay before the world pretty much went on lockdown. It's coming from Japan. Um, yeah, it'll, it'll get cleared up, uh, I mean, it'll, it'll come out soon. There's, it's just a, a big delay on, um, on shipping at the moment, really. I saw that, like, CD Japan uh, has piles and piles of parcels that they can't ship out right now. Interesting choices on those shots. Okay, no grenades. You are injured, but it's not as bad. And you did not get... Uh Blowed up. Thank you. Alright, that is a hybrid worker. Did he die? Huh. Yeah, I I, I turned uh, uh, the pupper one tile that that helped the uh, the dog. I'm just wondering if this guy died. Because I don't see the Z's. I don't think he was bleeding out. He's a hybrid worker. Let's go ahead and heal you up one more. There we go. Might have been a stray bullet. Oh, that's fair. we go.
Okay, in case a uh, guy comes around. Let's come over here. Yeah, I do have tasers. Um, just not everyone has them, and these weapon, the uh, stun rods are just better. They're more, much more effective, really. Okay, robot. You down here. All right, let's see how uh, this goes. Hopefully, that will be. Dang it. Dang it! Lots of grenades. Dang! All of the grenades! The hell? No grenades, please. Oh, you jerk! Oh no, he got up. Okay. Well. Uh, that was a lot of pain. How bad are you? One. Alright, not actually that bad. Do you mind hitting? Thank you. Thank you. Alright, that is extremely frustrating. Not enough energy. Hmm. Not enough energy for that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that would be uh, generally better, but that's also a lot of extra turn units, so sometimes it's a case of is it better to spend those turn units or is it better to... Uh, like, get behind for a better chance to hit. Hard to say sometimes. How many do I need to take captive? No idea. I just want to take as many of them captive as I can. I have no idea who is uh, doing the mind control right now. Yeah, I don't know, but I don't know which one is which. They look the exact same. Not a fan of that. Also not a fan of that. Doubly not a fan of that. Oh, this is before all of that, even. Okay, uh... What is causing those explosions? Because they don't appear to be grenades. Oh, there goes another grenade. Imagine an Iron Man zero casualty run of this game. That would be impossible. 
You'd stim to avoid overstun, let them pass out, carry, and stun again. Yeah. Uh, it's a lot of a lot of people, a lot of time units, a lot of movement. Let's see how it goes. All right, that guy got back up again. For crying out loud, what is causing those explosions? Because they do not appear to be grenades. I mean, sometimes they do. They are. That's a grenade. All right, I might have to roll further back. Might be time bombs? Did they put mines? I... Don't think so. I mean, well... I guess some of them might have, uh... He does not have a... Alright, uh, can I move anyone into the... No. Like, there might be a, uh, a primed grenade on someone. Could be landmines. I'm not seeing anything on the, uh, on the map. This guy does not. That's just a flashbang. This guy might, but I can't look at him. And he's the only other one, he's the only one that I can look at. No, because there were only two explosions and there were two thrown grenades there. It seems like there's something else blowing up. I know that the, the cars blow up sometimes too, but... They're like green explosions. Like that. Alright, Froxus is uh, injured again. I'll try going behind him. There we go. He is bleeding out. Three fatal wounds. You can take care of that, though, I think. Shoot. I did not mean to move you there. No grenade. No, nope, there's just something else that they're that they're doing. Bad alien gas from a space burrito. <laughs> that could be it. All right, there he goes. All right, need to come over here. There's someone here. Yep, not enough time units. All right, no, that's that's fine. This is the guy with the uh, laser rifle, and that might be a guy with, uh, psionics. The fact that he has the laser rifle. Not enough energy. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, and there's a guy back here with a laser pistol. Well, shoot. <laughs> Mistakes may have been made. Let's at least face him. Uh, you've got three fatal wounds. All 
All right, let's get up next to him. Lulu is still injured. Alright, let's get back here. There we go. Uh, Lulu, you just uh, hide up here. Lulu's done enough for this uh, mission. Alright, let's see how uh, badly it goes now. Thank you for winning CQC. Thank you for winning CQC. I do appreciate that. Good, good. Miss. No, 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 that's not missing. That is also not missing. Are laser rifles good at CQC? There's no energy to attempt. Oh. You have to have energy for it? I better face him then. How much energy do you need for CQC? Oh. Well, that's pretty awful. Alright. No, I mean, he was... failing. Oh, there comes a grenade. We're gonna have so many injured people here. Alright, let's see. You got four fatal wounds. Please take him out. goes that one. Hmm. I might need to just, like, pull back then. Uh, since I don't have any stims, uh, you have two fatal wounds. That's a nice pool. That is all I can do. Well, let's see how badly this goes. Well, I guess I'll try uh, CQC against him. Alright, Froxus. You get over here. Nope, no CQC, but you can do another stun attempt. There we go. Alright, Clinus, come over here. All right, let's see what happens. Bots can't? Well, we'll see. 
feel like I'd seen that happen before. Nope, you're right. Alright. How does he shoot through the door? Alright, just come over here. Still some mind control attempts. Alright, Froxus. Well, let's see. Linus, come over here. There we go. He's good. He has no uh, stamina, though. Looking forward to trying to getting everything out of this and then never having to stun any of these people ever again. Being able to just shoot their faces. I know he's there. Don't worry. back there. Well, he went down. So that's good. I guess a stun took him out. Alright. Strange artifact that looks like an alien grenade, but uh, the color is off. Advent Agent. Uh, let's go ahead and get you in here. <laughs> Nah, stay behind the door. Move to the side. Okay, how bad is this gonna go? That's not going great. Like I said, not going great. And Reclusive Hero dies. Okay. All right, Mumbles, uh, what uh, page do you want? That is a lot of shots. That is a lot of shots. Inclusive Hero's gone berserk. Uh, eh, he's, he can survive. 247, all right. Two forty seven. Um, the book doesn't have two hundred forty seven pages. Did I get the uh, no, two hundred twenty three pages is the most. Out of time units. Can I get you in here? Yes, I can. Two ten. All right. Oh, and you don't have anything to uh, heal with. Well, that's just great. 
All right, well, Reclusive Hero has a turn to survive. Oh, and you got up. Let's fix that. Go back to sleep. I said, go back to sleep. Thank you. Okay, 210. Alright, Chapter 7, Influence and Survivals. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Uh, but the culture was no longer viewed in the same way. Not only did the loss of its original language weaken its impact, but in time, its content was no longer understood as it used to be. The first commentaries on ancient myths date to the first millennium. Works that were once transparent increasingly had to be explained, a result of and contributing to a loss in understanding. Ancient myths, the texts of which were always faithfully recopied and consequently disseminated, were no longer considered to be explanatory. They had become distant memories of ancient history, traditions, and motifs, themes for expl explication. Moreover, it had been some time since such myths had been composed, people being content to present them as uh, so many illustrations of rituals or of liturgical activities. Even the view of the gods changed. A more frequent, more immediate contact with foreign divinities that occurred before seems to have revived an ancient penchant for syncretism, which had long been active in the land. The traditional well-known recognition in Mesopotamia of the supernatural nature of foreign divinities sometimes suggests that in the polytheistic world, they above all saw divine functions, sovereignty over the world, its creation and its uh, government, justice, the animation and moderation of various great mechanisms of nature and culture, etc., rather than divine figures. These functions were carried out by figures whose names and appearances might vary. E.g. Kamula was Ia among the Kassites, and Lahura Til was Ninurta among the people of Subartu and were thus to be considered secondary, as illustrated at the end of the Epic of Creation. Let the black-headed folk be divided as to gods, but by whatever name we call him, let Marduk be our god. See you, Sealand Mortar. Thanks for uh, coming out. Hmm. Can I get through here. I can. I want to kind of keep this guy from moving too much, ideally. Alright, let's see how this goes. Probably not going to go well. Alright, there are some more injuries. Kalinus is injured again. I think Froxus needs to do the uh, healing. Oh, and that guy's up. Great. Okay, that's... Uh... No, cancel. Drop that. Shoot. Alright. Heal. Alright, Pac-Man Red, do you have anything? You do. Alright, so I think that, because that guy just got up, he'll, he's surrendering. There we go. All right, let's save it just to be on the safe side. Yep, there we go. All right. Ooh, all right. Enemies killed three, corpses recovered four, live enemies captured six for 272 points, 16 uh, enemies surrendered one for 16 points, artifacts recovered one for one point, 333 points, noticeable rating. Zaku 2 got nothing. 
Uh, Lulu, one turn unit, four stamina, two hit points, one melee, eight sanity. Pac-Man Red, one reaction, one melee, four sanity. Uh, Reclusive Hero, four melee, one sanity. Pardon me, Froxus, two melee, two sanity. Uh, Kalinus, ten bravery, one reaction. North Star Avalon, three stamina, ten bravery, three reactions, two melee, one strength, and two sanity. Rufert, three stamina, two hit points, and one sanity. Okay. Loot-wise, we got uh, combat knives, of course, black ops rifles, selling those, chem pistols, laser pistols, laser rifles, black ops sniper rifle, I can, I'll keep it for now, black ops LMG, RPG launcher, grenade, plasma grenade, one wad of cash, three refined humans, leads to infiltration hybrids. Uh, hybrid corpses, which I can sell off some of those. Hmm, only th only hybrid workers. That's unfortunate. So hybrid network, alien purge, alien base, hybrid experimental farm, hybrid storage facility. And Advent Agent. Uh, Advent Agent Combat Analysis, Hybrid Network, Impersonation Prerequisite Advent. Uh, gives one for free, all of those. Uh, a couple dossiers. Actually, quite a few dossiers. Alright, that's good stuff. Kind of disappointed the disappointing that I only got hybrid workers though. All right, reclusive hero, second award, correctional officer, solid Zaku two, Keystone, North Star Avalon, first award, patient, reclusive hero, fourth award, second award for Froxus and Kalinus, third award for Rufert, battle scarred Lulu, first award, uh, Froxus and Kalinus, second award, elite, North Star Avalon, third award. Ah, oh, that was, uh, that was a mission. Alright. Red Dawn Memory Card. We have successfully decoded the memory card, which looks awfully familiar. All of the Red Dawn secrets, including names, addresses, logbooks, expenses, contacts, aliases, estates, we have it all, Commander. Their future is in your hands. I have the data ready for disclosure to the right people. If this is done, the Red Dawn is finished, but ultimately it's your call. If and when we want to do this, I will support your every decision. Okay. We can now research Terminate the Red Dawn. I think that I'd like to do that, so I don't have to deal with them anymore. Terminate the Red Dawn. There we go. Let's see what else pops up. Probably not going to do another mission unless it's something like a... Uh, Strange life form. Personal armor. Let's get some personal armor made. Alright, research completed on Cyberweb plans. The documentation we have procured speaks about Cyberweb's project of developing portals to other dimensions. As improbable as it sounds, it seems they not only succeeded in doing just that, but have been sending personnel and materials through such dimensional portals for quite a long time now, which suggests a major operation uh, of theirs on the other side. The portal uses a medium called subspace and is highly unstable, which led to several accidents involving serious losses. In the end, however, Cyberweb developed a method of controlling it by directly hooking a battery of optronic supercomputers to it. Still, it is impossible to predict how long a portal will remain open. If we develop a way of tracking subspace disturbances caused by operating a portal, we can pinpoint it and dispatch a squad to seize it. Alright. Let's see. There's a lot of things that I would like to uh, work on. Oh, I got aquaplastics. I didn't realize that. What do those lead to? Sonic weapons, cal calibration, coelacanth, aquaplastic suit, a vibroblade, and zerbite drive. 
alien organ sample. Doesn't really give me much. Alien embryo. Alien communicator. UFO signature. I have some floaters that I could research. Uh, Eldritch Language, I don't think that I've, uh... Yeah, that leads to a lot of things. Let's, uh, let's get on that. Oh, we got a strange life form. Alright, uh, you do need some changes to the craft. Wounded for five days, wounded for 13 days. Whatever name is available, Hessen Shadowbane. That's a good mission for some rookies. I need some armor on you, though. And I don't have any armor for you. There we go. Alright, so we'll do this mission. Should be pretty pretty fast. Uh let's patrol until it's daytime though. Whoa, Nelly. Alien Embassy. There is significant UFO activity in this area. We associate this activity with the recent government complex. Our agents will not be able to examine what is happening inside without attracting attention of government forces. The connection between the activities of the employees of this complex and the abrupt change of policy regarding the country's support for the XCOM project is evident. A direct attack on the complex without preliminary investigation would be ineffective and would only provoke the country's government to retaliate and hurt XCOM's public image. Okay, so, uh... We... Yeah, we can't do that yet. Um, but it sounds like we might be able to get them back as a funding nation if we take them out. That would be pretty cool. You do? That is pretty awesome. Alright. Uh, let's wait a little bit longer for daytime. I think that's good enough. Just need to go hard, vicious, and calculated with damn good tech. Yeah, yeah, I definitely don't have damn good tech, that's for sure. Okay, Juffo up, you're fine. Mr. Maze Man, that's fine. Title Rabbit is okay. Roused Hour. Youth Begets Stupidity. Uh, whatever name is available. Okay, not that. You definitely can't carry that. Uh, let's go with a pistol. And Hessen Shadowbane. A little bit overloaded, but that's okay. Oh great, giant beetles. All right, who wants to take that one out? Title Rabbit. Well, that's disappointing. Please kill it. Well, I'm glad that didn't do any damage. Ugh. How do you guys have such good armor, anyway? You're friggin' beetles. It's 
a hit. It's bleeding. It's not dead. Do not make me restart this mission just so that I can kill a freaking beetle. Um, I think it's I, I think it's not just everyone. I, I think it happens before you lose everyone. Oh, about time, jeez. If it's like the uh, original game, at least. All right, let's see how bad they come in and eat our faces. They are not. Yeah, two consecutive uh, months with enough minus score, that's right. Although I suppose if you're doing enough, well enough, um, you could keep going until you have just one uh, funding nation. But I'm pretty sure if you lose all the funding nations, uh, that's it. Thank you, about time. Okay. Alright, where do we want to uh, set up to hunt these guys? I suppose over here could do, do could work. Uh, you are not dead. You're probably in, uh, in traction. <laughs> You're probably in the um, infirmary for a very long time. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I am not a fan of these guns that much, really. They're very shotgun-like. You gotta be close. Got a few over there. Juffo up. Let's get you up here. I hope there are no more uh, Bombardier Beetles. Because those are just annoying. Alright, let's just get everyone up here. Uh, I guess not you two right now. Not enough energy. That's gonna do it. Uh, Mr. Maze Man doesn't see anything. I guess for now I will come up here then. Tidal Rabbit as well. I guess we can have two. Uh... Hmm. 
two positions to fire from. I mean, all the beetles are pretty far away, so I'm not too worried about it. Aim shot? Yeah, no. You're not hitting anything. Alright. Oh, there is a civilian. Sorry, civilian. Ah, oh, crap. Dang it. <sighs> Stupid misclicks. Okay, we're just going to get uh, reaction fire from you guys. There we go. Alright. Probably kill the civilian in the process. We go. Another one down. This is pretty good for training uh, reactions. Oddly enough, that the uh, the beetles are not going for the civilian. I don't know why. All right, Hessen. You need 20, so go ahead and take a seat. There we go. Okay, these are close enough. Very nice. Very nice. TV's Frank get, gets two kills. Nice. Very nice. Ah, uh, it's nice to hear them just die without me having to find them and click on them and everything like that. Uh, you have fired a couple. Zero percent. What's the worst that could happen? You know, other than missing. Take pot shots at them. Giant beetle is panicked. Giant beetle is panicked. I love the idea of giant beetles panicking. No, not Paul. Ringo, run, hide. Oh, that's terrible. Yeah, all misses. That's expected. Giant beetle has gone berserk. Well, there goes the civilian. Sorry, civilian. 
Not my fault. You should have moved behind our defensive position. Oh god, do we all live in a yellow submarine? I don't know! Beatles panicking, everyone. Alright, how about we... start doing a little bit of hunting. Who can see that one? Uh, you can. It's not exactly very close to hitting, now is it? I should have just let you, uh, overwatch. Ten percent chance! No chance. TV's Frank. Zero percent. All right. Giant Beetle has gone berserk. Giant Beetle is panicked. Giant Beetle is panicked. Who can see it? You need to reload. Uh, we'll come back to you. You can see it. Something? No line of fire. Well, shoot anyway. Yeah, that's why you have to take the fight to uh, to the aliens, because you don't have the resources. Nah, I'll just save it for a uh, reaction. Nope. One has died. Who knew there were so many more beetles in four? I know. Nah, I didn't think so. Uh, I need sixty-eight. So let's come over here. Aim shot. Right to the butt. Alright, I got two shots left. Let's come over here. I'm going to wait to see if it comes closer. It is panicked. Alright, Frank. There we go. Enemies killed 14. Corpses recovered 14. Civilians killed by enemies 1. Minus 30 points. 83, a satisfactory rating. TV's Frank, 2 accuracy. Jeffo up, 2 turn units, 3 stamina, 1 hit points, 1 reaction, 4 accuracy, 2 strength, 2 sanity. Mr. Mazeman, 3 turn units, 4 stamina, uh, 1 reaction, 1 accuracy, 2 strength, and 4 sanity. Title Rabbit, 2 Sanity. Roused Hour, 2 Hit Points. Youth Begets Stupidity, 3 Turn Units and Stamina, 2 Hit Points, 1 Reaction, 1 Accuracy, 2 Strength, and 2 Sanity. Uh, whatever name is available, 2 Turn Units, 2 Stamina, 3 Reactions, 3 Accuracy, 2 Strength, 6 Sanity, and Hessen Shadowbane, uh, 3 Turn Units, 1 Stamina, 1 Accuracy, 3 Strength, and 2 Sanity. Giant Beetle Corpses. I uh, will keep them. 
Okay. Uh, Roused Hour, second award for Solid. Ice Cold Killer, TV's Frank, first award. And Tidal Rabbit, second award. Lucky, Hessen Shadowbane, first award. Overwatcher, fourth award for Tidal Rabbit. Roused Hour, Trooper, first award. Okay. Production of Sky Raider at Cahokia is complete. Okay. So it can hold 10 people rather than 8. Um, it's not quite as good as I would... Oh my lord, look at all the wounded people. That is a lot of wounded people. Lulu is wounded for 6 days. Pac-Man Red, 7 days. Kalinus, 9 days. Froxus, 13 days. Rufert, 21 days. Reclusive Hero, 47 days. That's, uh... I'm, I'm like, not even going to be able to, uh... Field a, a team here. Hey, North Star Avalon made it through that one, okay? He's like, I don't know what, what's wrong with you guys. I'm, I'm fine. All right, so I have that. Um, I think we'll get rid of the Mad Mart Copter. I just, I just pulled everyone off of everything. I didn't know that would happen. Alright, 11 days. Move you around. Two days. And nine days. And 15 days. Okay. Alright, Mad Mart Copter. Time to say goodbye. That's why you need a damn sick bay. Well, I do have one on every base. It's right there. Let's send over the Sky Raider. Alright, equip craft, uh, Nomad Fly, let's get eight people on board. Meridian, Archer C4 Wilco, Abcody, Kijagoon, Sierra Mike, Zakad, Colonel Kruk, uh, you know what, I'm gonna need to check the, ar yeah, I've got too many people with shields. Uh, Sierra Mike, but Zakad and Colonel Krukov need to come off. Canis Rufus and Mr. Wolverine can get on board. I'm not going to have enough to a field on the um, on the other sh craft, though. Okay, we can manufacture other things. Um... Let's go with personal armor. Uh, no, not personal armor. Actually, let's uh, let's get some. Oh, I do have the tech for chem pistols. I didn't realize that. Let's get alien alloys. And we can get some more uh, personal armor and stuff. Alright. Equip craft. Let's go ahead and uh, call this the... Malroth 3. There you go, little bunny. Yeah, you can train rats. I can, you can take them out like uh, dogs. I, I don't know that they're any good, but... Uh, 
Alright, so Kilkakon, you need to be up closer to the front. Maybe it's time for more rookies? Uh, no, no, it's just that we have a lot of wounded people. Um, I have a, a thing for voluntary names, but I'm low on names right now. Uh, I haven't made a new base in a little while. So we're just gonna run with that. And it's just about end the end of the uh, stream anyway. Let's just see what we get for next time. Secret Clinic Found. Oh my. Suspicious Clinic. We have found a suspicious medical institution. This recently opened private clinic provides incredibly innovative treatments at extremely low prices for the region. We were unable to establish any sources of funding for this institution. Monitoring of the surrounding area uncovered some periodically appearing reports of residents who turned, returned to the clinic for hospitalization, but then disappeared. However, any information regarding these cases instantly are skillfully suppressed by unknown forces. The same external surveillance of the clinic has established that white vans regularly arrive at the object. Um, Ariyaru, do you know if this, uh, or anyone else, do you know if this is one of those missions where you ha you go in in lab coats? I mean, it doesn't say... Alright, it's not saying that I can't tar... Okay, you go in full gear? Alright. Okay. Uh, let's... Let me save it real fast. I want to make sure that... Uh, I can get there. I think I might want to take the Malroth. Have more people. All right, I got six. I need four more. Actually, I think I might want to take Meridian. Let's do that. You already need uh, Malroth's help again. Alright, there we go. Meridian is on board. We got three people's shields. So I am going to need some extra SMGs. Alright. Scout drone ammo. Take some electric clubs along, but all of the electric prods... No, not the electric prods, the uh, stun rods. Taser pistols. Taser cannon. Dart rifle, although I don't know that I'll use it. Black Ops pistols. Uh, I haven't bought any UAC pistols. I'm not sure if I can get them. Just rush in, guns blazing, take no prisoners. Well, I might want to take some prisoners, actually. Prisoners tend to be pretty good. Sniper rifle. I do not have an auto sniper rifle. Hmm. Alright, I need to purchase some things. You consider these clinic maps one of the more annoying ones. Interesting. 
Uh, I don't think I don't need a public car anymore. Let me uh, hide that. Um, don't need the Mud Ranger. Don't need the helicopter. I don't think I'm going to do the Osprey. So let's just hide those. Okay, I need a Black Ops Auto Sniper Rifle. Any ammo. Oh, I should get some uh, UAC pistols. Yeah, it's fine. I need to sell off some things. All right, equip craft. Uh, let's go ahead and take... Let's see, Haley's Eel. You don't have anything on you. I'm most definitely not going in with Tommy guns. No. No way. Okay, I need the... I can take the smart rifle off of that. Get that one off. I'll get it back on. Alright. There's the auto sniper. Okay. Uh, do, do, do. I could actually take the auto shotgun. I've got enough clips for it. We'll try that. Light cannon. Can't do the uh, heavy cannon. Black Ops Minigun. Black Ops LMG. Maybe I'll take two just in case. UAC Rocket Launcher, just in case. Grenade Launcher. I am very low on high explosive grenades. I don't think I care about the smoke grenades for it. I have way too many grenades, too. I need to sell a lot of those. Eh, just one motion scanner. Electro flares, trace flares. You can never have too many grenades. Well, that's what Lel Bunny says. That's, But uh, I, I'm not sure that I believe her. Alright, I'm very low on advanced healing spray as well. I probably don't need this many medical items either. Especially if I'm taking so many trauma packs. Uh, pickaxe and a fire extinguishers. Okay. So other things that I need to buy are, are advanced healing sprays. Let's hide the golden dragons. I don't need those. Need more of those. That's good. Running out, running out of meds in the craft is hell. Yeah, especially when you have to make so many of them. Well, even though it's refueling, it does have the range. Um, Alright, let me save it again so that I can try to make sure that it is going to be a daytime mission. 
I'm not sure exactly how fast this uh, craft flies. It is ready. But we are going to be doing that next time. All right. And dart pistol clip A's. Well, I guess I'll uh, come up with something else to make here. Um, personal armor? Yeah, I'll make 12 for now. OUTs. Well, it is getting late. I need to eat. I need to eat dinner. Uh, I will go ahead and sell some stuff off uh, off screen. Uh, let me see if anyone is streaming right now. I've really been raiding too many people on Monday nights. Um, so sure, yeah, let's uh, let's go ahead and raid uh, Hungry Goria. Uh, looks like she's playing some Fantasy Star Four. Four. So I will see you guys. On Tuesday for more of, uh, not Tuesday for on Wednesday for more of uh, this. We'll do this mission. We'll see how long it lasts. See you then, everyone. <laughs>